On the lateral side, there is a lateral collateral ligament complex, which is made up of three ligaments. At the front is the anterior talofibular ligament, ATFL, connecting the talus to the lateral malleolus. This ligament limits plantar flexion and the anterior displacement of talus, and is the weakest of the lateral ligaments. In a lateral ankle sprain, the ATFL is usually the most commonly injured. Just behind the ATFL is the calcaneofibular ligament, or CFL, connecting the calcaneus and lateral malleolus. It allows talocrural dorsiflexion and plantar flexion, and limits inversion when the ankle is in the neutral position. Finally, at the back is the posterior talofibular ligament, or PTFL, connecting the talus to the lateral malleolus at the back. This is the strongest of the lateral ligaments, playing only a supplementary role when the rest of the ligaments are intact. It limits posterior displacement and external rotation of the talus, and is under the greatest strain during ankle dorsiflexion. The lateral ligaments are commonly sprained due to the relative instability between the talus and fibula, usually occurring in excessive inversion and plantar flexion. When someone says they rolled their ankle, this is usually what has happened.